Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna get up close and personal with my AMG GT Black Series 1 Edition. Let's talk about the exterior. This car has so much downforce, over 900 pounds at top speed, and I just found out there's a manual adjustment for the front diffuser that even gives you more downforce. And it's somewhere down here. Let's take a look. Oh, huh? I see it. There we go. Ah, ah, ah. My bicep workout. <laughs> look at that. I think I'm gonna leave it on. And I'm told there's two little brackets here. You can put the wires that will screw right in here to keep the little lip. Wow, this car needs a detail. Anyhow, I haven't even looked under the hood yet, but let's open the hood. So 720 horsepower and the most powerful AMG engine ever built. All right, let's see what we got. This car actually has 140 horsepower more than the GTR Pro and it's 80 pounds lighter. So the difference is this car has flank crank engine and also bigger turbos. 140 horses, that's a lot. And 80 pounds lighter, sign me up. All right, let's go look at the rear. There we go. The rear is really cool. It's got the air brake, so there's an active air brake. Very similar to AMG One, and also the SLRs have the air brake. But look at the massive size of this wing and the rear diffuser, wow. This is probably the widest rear I've seen in my fleet. And what's cool is you can manually adjust the rear ring if you got a hex Allen wrench, which um, I don't own one yet, but that'd be cool. I wonder what it will do if you stick it in there and probably come out like the front left. That'd be cool. We gotta try that, Nate. So before we go to the interior, I wanna show you guys how the active rear wing works. All right, where is that rear ring? Pretty cool, eh? Another cool feature is if for some reason your starter push button doesn't work, you have another option to turn on the car and you'll just open this up and look at this. Second ignition. Woo! Now that's pretty cool. I don't know if I'm ever gonna need it, but other cool things, obviously you got the traction adjuster here so you can increase or reduce your traction control as you wish. And of course, I got my really cool exclusive for AMG One Team badge right here. That's only for AMG One Edition Black Series. What else do we got here? So many buttons. Suspensions. Let's turn on the car. You got your exhaust here. Your adjustable wing. Speakers. I don't listen to music. All right, what do we got here? Comfort zone, a sport mode. This thing has so many different driving modes. It's got a slippery, individual, comfort, a sport, a sport plus, race mode. Of course, we gotta go down to race mode. Here we go. And then you got the adjustable shocks. You can put a sport or comfort. Traction control off here. So this traction control is completely off at this point. You can see it right here, it's all red and I don't dare to drive it with that thing off. And you can change it from automatic to manual. There we go, pedal shifters. If you wanna check out your garage, different view modes. Wow, that's a good view, guys. Very nice. All right, should we go look at the rear? Now you have to admit, the rear of this car is probably my favorite. It's the sexiest rear end, whoa. Now let's see what we got here. We got some goodies. Hat, t-shirt, compliments of Fletcher Jones, coffee mug. You guys know I love my coffee in the morning. And I think this must be the cover. Wait a minute, what do we got here? Wow, this is the first time a car manufacturer has given me the batteries to the fob. Never happens. What do we got here? Hey, this is kind of neat. Ashtray? It's an ashtray. 
a little too small for my fat cigars, but hey, this may do. What is that here? Ah, these are the cables for the front. Very cool. Man, the only thing they didn't put in here is a pair of socks. Is it a love letter? Your access to the AMG private lounge? No way. I guess we're going to a lounge, Nate. No, this is an online lounge. I'm already a member, of course, from the AMG One customer. What's, but that's what cool. do they do with the lounge? Do you like talk to other owners? Or? Yeah, so really? all the owners are on there. They talk about different events. Sometimes they get together. And then, of course, updates on your car. And these are probably lug nuts. All right, I have no idea what these are. I'm told these are for camber adjustments for the suspension. If you're on the track, uh, I better call a mechanic. And I think that's it. Wait a minute, there is more. This must be my charger. Very nice. All right. Last but not least, a leather wallet. No, it's just a manual. Actually, I have to be honest, this is a lot of accessory for a $370,000 car. And, uh, oh, there's one more. Maybe an umbrella? Ah, it's a trunk screen. I thought it was a tent. Wow, look at this. Unlike other GT models, this thing comes with full carbon. Very nice. All right. There we go. And the tires are super special too. You see the picture of the AMG Black Series. Michelin made these tires just for the AMG GT Black Series. And I can't even imagine what's the cost of replacement of these tires. And of course, as you guys know, every Black Series has the white body, which is what makes it look so aggressive and so gorgeous. And this is no different. And all the panels of carbon fiber. And man, I gotta say, I love those stars embedded in the paint. First, I thought it was a sticker, but Mercedes did an amazing job. That would be a cool video to see how they actually accomplished this. And then contouring the paint from black to silver. And what makes this car so special, this is only available to the AMG One owners, and the option costs $47,500, and has a custom paint, as you guys can see. There's only two options. You can either get it in entirely in black with the white stars, or you can get the silver with the black rear that contours into the silver. And you don't really get that much choice to add or take off any other thing. 47,500 and you're married to everything AMG is gonna put in the car. And it's only 41 of these in the world. Most of the AMG One owners sadly didn't opt for this option. I can't wait for my AMG One to come. It's gonna have the same exact spec, side by side, is gonna be a view you can't miss. So with that said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be safe, be well, make sure you subscribe, like the video. See you guys next week. So I sold this for 40.7 million. Uh, two years ago, so I made about close to $12 million. Residential investors work longer hours for lower returns compared to commercial real estate investors. Contrarian Academy helps residential investors successfully acquire their first commercial property in six months or less. So there's a lot of pockets of opportunity where you can take great real estate that's located in a great location and repurpose it. While one state, for example, Houston, that's heavily invested in oil and gas industry is experiencing a recession, you may have another state like California experiencing the economic boom. You don't really have to wait for a global economic recession to jump out and invest your money and buy real estate. Apply now by clicking the link below.